Paul Christie, and you led a discussion in the webinar about the career path of an internet manager. And we figured since many of you may be internet managers or uh, soon to be, and you wonder what happens after that. What do you become? So let's ask this esteemed panel, what happens uh, when you move beyond an internet manager? What do you become? Where do you go? What are you preparing yourself for? And so, Christy, you get to lead that one. Sure, even though I was asking the question, but I'll try to answer it. Um, I really like when we kind of throw around the term of CIO, Chief Internet Officer, I think Martin might have said it in his presentation too. Um, but I like the whole idea of um, different different departments that I've heard mentioned uh, over the past couple of days. I think information management, um, knowledge management, and to me the whole idea of this, and this is thrown out another big discussion point this, this week, the whole idea of the digital workforce really intrigues me because I am in corporate communications and um, where that made sense to me even as much as a year ago, I started to question it, especially with my, in terms of thinking where I, what I want to do next in my career um, as we go mobile and as we get into the, the social aspect of technology. Um, I don't feel like maybe communications makes, makes sense for me anymore. Um, but does IT or, you know, I don't know where it fits, so I almost see things evolving into its own organization where it's this digital workforce where, you know, the remote access, the, the, the tools, the applications that you, that you use to do your job, things that en enable you to do your job better that you need day to day, somebody's got to manage that and maybe that's a separate organization and maybe I will be put into that organization as the CIO. And be given lots of power. That's my hope. <laughs> Martin, I can only share that hope. That's for sure. Uh, <laughs> and I see. I I I feel many of the same thing as as uh, Krista just mentioned. So I see. I also see the role evolving into something. Uh, that's not, it's not communications, it's not HR, it's not IT, it's uh, somewhere in between all that and it's still a corporate function that kind of holds the company together, uh, it, well, on the digital front. I know now it starts to sound like we're saving the world here, but let's just, let's just stay in the holes, just stay, in that, stay with that for a while. Um, but yeah, I'm sure that there, there will be a career path, but it also comes down to how well is your intranet uh, embedded into your organization. If it's, if it's still something that you use, well, we'll still be here in five years, have not having moved at all. But if you get it embedded into everyday life, I think the world will change, and only then will it change. Julie, please. Uh, this is a hard question, not least given that I've only had the job a week, so I'm just <laughs> <laughs> kind, of, kind of thinking about how I do this job rather than the next one, to be perfectly honest. Um, I've heard Jerry McGovern speak on this subject, and, and his, his view is, is an, an intriguing one in that um, information management, which is where I'm, I'm, I sit in the organization, I think that is the right home for internet, so I don't think it should be in HR or um, IT or, or internal comms. Um, but the, the fact that organizations will come to realize that, that looking after this, this resource is absolutely crucial and I think it will become increasingly high profile and important. Um, and I would very much like to see the creation of a um, CINTO, if we can call it that, um, um, or have, have an information manager, a, a CIO in the traditional sense, not just mean uh, IT, which is rather what it, what it does. Um, I think we're at a, uh, we're, not, we're not at a crossroads yet, but I think, I think um, uh, Things, ch things are changing. I think uh, for us as, as, as internet people, I think it's quite, uh, uh, quite an exciting place to be uh, from a career progression and path point of view. So a message of hope. That was very nice <laughs> for the minute one week on the job. Uh, Gabriel, please. Uh, okay. Um, uh, it's a very tricky question. I agree on that. Uh, I would say like, uh, you know, it, it's hard to predict Especially, it's hard to predict about the future. And um, <laughs> what I mean by that is that we, we I, I think we really don't know today how this world would look like, the world we're in, in about five years. And I, I think we touched on this this morning that, okay, 
couple of years ago, and still today, there is something called an intranet manager. Well, maybe there is a digital workplace um, director or <coughs> something, but it, the world will not look the way it looks today. And basically, I, th I just think, without knowing, that there will be a lot of new ways, channels of communication that's related to electronic stuff that we don't know about today. Who knew about Flickr three years ago? Etc. 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 You know, we are in a business that develops so fast and faster, I would say, than anything else. The only thing I know for sure is this was, will develop, it will grow, and the importance will increase. Um, <coughs> hopefully, that will lead that the intranet managers will have some kind of a possibility to find a job in the future. <laughs> <laughs>